the James Webb Telescope has provided the clearest image of Proxima b in history, uncovering stunning revelations about this potentially habitable exoplanet. Join us as we embark on a journey through space to uncover the mysteries of Proxima b and explore whether it could be the next Earth. Proxima b orbits Proxima Centauri, a red dwarf star located 4.2 light-years away from Earth. This planet, often referred to as Earth's cousin, is surrounded by mystery and wonder. Could it harbor oceans and life flowing on its surface? But wait, there's more. Proxima b isn't alone in its orbit around Proxima Centauri. It has a companion, Proxima c, which could reveal even more secrets about this star system. Perhaps there's yet another companion we haven't discovered. The mystery continues. Proxima Centauri emits nearly the same amount of energy as Earth receives from the Sun. Could this mean water exists on Proxima b? Is life as we know it possible beyond our solar system? As we venture further into space, we encounter a whole new universe of exoplanets, planets that orbit stars other than our Sun. With 200 billion stars in the Milky Way galaxy alone, the possibilities for exoplanets are endless. Some even drift through space, untethered to any star, like rogue planets. Among them, Proxima Centauri b stands out as an extraordinary and enigmatic planet. Proxima b has a year that lasts just 11.2 Earth days, and it orbits much closer to its star than Earth does to the Sun. This means one side of the planet is constantly bathed in light, while the other remains in eternal darkness. Let's now dive into Proxima Centauri, the star around which Proxima b orbits. Proxima Centauri is part of the Alpha Centauri triple star system. This system includes Alpha Centauri A and B, two G-type and K-type stars that appear as one in the constellation Centaurus, making them the third brightest stars in our night sky. Proxima Centauri, also known as Alpha Centauri C, is a red dwarf star, an M-type star located 4.24 light-years away from the other two stars, making it the closest star to our solar system. The name's Proxima means the nearest in Latin, and it was discovered in 1915 by Scottish astronomer Robert Thorburn. Despite being the closest star to us, Proxima Centauri remains invisible to the naked eye due to its dimness, with an apparent magnitude of 11.13, well beyond the limit of human vision. However, don't let that fool you. Proxima Centauri is still an important star to study. Red dwarfs like Proxima Centauri are among the most energy-efficient stars. Although they don't emit much light, their internal convection processes allow them to shine for trillions of years. In fact, Proxima Centauri will remain a main-sequence star for another 4 trillion years. The habitability of a red dwarf like Proxima Centauri is still a topic of debate. One challenge is that Proxima Centauri is a flare star meaning it undergoes frequent and irregular bursts of radiation. As a low-mass star, its habitable zone is much closer to it than the sun's, roughly between 0.23 and 54 cents. However, even this habitable zone may not be as suitable as it seems. Proxima b may lack a stable atmosphere, which is crucial for maintaining liquid water on its surface. Without this stability, life would be vulnerable to space weather, making it exceedingly difficult for life to thrive. While Proxima b may appear Earth-like on the surface, it's far from guaranteed to support life. Still, many continue to hold hope. One tool that has captured the attention of astronomers is the James Webb Space Telescope. After several delays, the telescope was finally launched in 2018, and it will help determine whether life exists on Proxima b. However, as with all things in science, things are never as clear-cut as they may seem. Changes were important to guarantee the James Webb Telescope could convey precise pictures, as Abby Bend, a hypothetical physicist at Harvard, makes sense of. If a planet like Proxima b absorbs light from its star, it can also re-emit that light as infrared radiation. The James Webb Telescope was explicitly designed to identify infrared light, allowing it to capture pictures of this radiation on the planet's surface and search for patterns that could confirm whether the planet has water or an atmosphere. But what if the planet's atmosphere isn't suitable for life? The presence of an atmosphere doesn't guarantee life, warns Ed Turner, an astrophysicist at Princeton University. Proxima b could be like Venus, with a thick atmosphere far denser than Earth's, 
resulting in extreme heat that would make life impossible. The mission to reveal the truth about Proxima b is not without its challenges. While the James Webb Telescope holds promise, there are many factors to consider. With costs mounting, space scientists are feeling the pressure to figure out how to study planets like Proxima b. The stakes are high, but the rewards are even greater. The opportunity for a brief look into the unknown, to uncover the mysteries of a planet that could hold the potential for life, is one any serious researcher would pursue. But can we even travel to Proxima b? It's the closest exoplanet to us, which makes it exciting. It's almost like exploring our astronomical backyard. Even more fascinating is the fact that it's nearly the same size as Earth. Its position in the habitable zone means it could potentially have conditions suitable for life. Proxima b's proximity makes it a viable target for our search for life beyond Earth. At just 4.2 light years away, it's an ideal candidate for interstellar missions. Now, consider the possibility of exploring this Earth-like exoplanet. However, we can't go there just yet, but it's certainly on the radar for future missions as technology advances, making it more accessible. It's one of the most incredible possibilities in the field of space exploration. However, it's no simple task to get there. It would take 75,000 years for a spacecraft like the Voyager 2 to reach the Proxima Centauri system. Nevertheless, a proposal has been made involving solar sails, ultra-thin sails that could be used to accelerate a spacecraft toward the Alpha Centauri system, with Proxima B included. This technology uses solar pressure to keep the spacecraft on course, eliminating the issue of running out of fuel. With speeds predicted at 10 to 20% of the speed of light, the journey to the Alpha Centauri system could be reduced to just 20 years. The discovery of Proxima b has reignited humanity's interest in space exploration. It has given us a renewed sense of hope that we are not alone in the universe. The James Webb Telescope is a marvel of modern technology, capable of taking us as far back as the very beginning of the universe, 13.7 billion years ago. This is the carefully guarded secret, the farther an object. The more it takes for light to contact us, this implies the James Webb Telescope can notice objects in the universe farther away than some other telescope before it. Also, it can distinguish these objects in longer frequencies of infrared light, permitting us to see more distant stars with greater clarity than at any other time. And here's something considerably cooler. This mind-blowing innovation can provide insight into the possibility of life on different planets, like Proxima b. However, very much like with anything, there are some outstanding limits. The presence of an atmosphere doesn't necessarily ensure life. Proxima b could be like Venus, with a thick, cold atmosphere. But get this, the James Webb Telescope can recognize such conditions if they reach a brightness of just 5% of the planet's dayside. While 5% probably won't seem like much, it's entirely significant when dealing with a star that is generally dimmer than our sun. If Proxima b has intelligent life, they may be using bright orbital mirrors to reflect sunlight from the day side of the planet to the night side. How cool is that? There are countless exoplanets waiting to be discovered in our universe. These planets come in all shapes and sizes, with some being colossal gas giants, while others look like our own Earth. One kind of exoplanet that has grabbed the attention of space experts is the gas giant. These planets are comparable in structure to Jupiter and Saturn, but are much larger. Some of these behemoths have been named Super Jupiters, outperforming even the largest planet in our solar system. However, that's not all. There are also hot Jupiters, gas monsters that orbit incredibly close to their host star. They exist in a burning climate with temperatures high enough to melt metal. Imagine being able to observe such a planet up close, with its fuming storms and extreme heat. In addition to gas giants, there are also Neptunian exoplanets which are similar in size to Uranus and Neptune. Among these are hot Neptunes and mini-Neptunes, which are smaller and closer to their host stars than their gas giant cousins. These planets are often shrouded in mystery, making their atmospheres difficult to study from a distance. Furthermore, we should not disregard terrestrial exoplanets, those that resemble our own Earth. These planets come in various sizes, from smaller than Earth to twice its size. There are also super-Earths, which have masses greater than twice that of our planet but are lighter than Neptune. 
One of the most interesting exoplanets discovered recently is Proxima Centauri b, which orbits the star of the same name. This planet is called a super-Earth, with a rocky mass three times that of Earth. Despite being close to its host star, it is still far enough away to be considered outside the habitable zone. Proxima Centauri b isn't alone. It has a companion, Proxima Centauri c, which orbits farther from the star. This planet has an orbital period of around 5 Earth years and was found in 2020 using pre-recovery Hubble data. What's even more intriguing about Proxima Centauri c is that it appears to be an exceptionally bright world, potentially due to the presence of a ring system. There are more discoveries yet to be made in the Proxima Centauri system. In 2019, astronomers identified a change in the star's rotational rate, which could be the result of another planetary companion. If confirmed, this planet would be called Proxima Centauri d and would be roughly the size of Mercury or Mars. Imagine a reality where the night sky is filled with stars, as well as countless other planets, each with its unique qualities and orbits. The universe is full of surprises, and exoplanets are just one of them. With new discoveries being made constantly, it's an exciting time to be a space expert. While we don't yet have an exact count of exoplanets, we do know they exist in abundance throughout the universe. Exoplanets aren't easily observable. It takes cutting-edge technology and powerful telescopes to detect them. These planets are often hidden by the glare of their host stars, making them difficult to study. However, with advancements in technology, direct imaging of exoplanets is now possible. For an exoplanet to be directly imaged, it must be large enough to be visible by the telescope far enough from its host star to avoid being obscured by its glare, and young enough to be hot and detectable from Earth. These requirements limit the number of exoplanets that can currently be directly imaged, but they offer a fascinating glimpse into the properties and formation of these distant worlds. Exoplanets are usually discovered through the effects they have on their host stars. The gravitational pull of an exoplanet can cause its star to wobble and this change in the star's motion can be detected by astronomers. The Kepler Space Telescope used the transit method, which measures the dimming of a star's light when an exoplanet passes in front of it. This method has provided a wealth of data about exoplanets, including their size, distance, and temperature. Here are a couple of fascinating facts. Did you know that more than 22% of stars like the Sun have Earth-sized planets in their habitable zones? Or that Trappist, one is home to seven rocky exoplanets with water on their surfaces. Exoplanets in our solar system can also have natural satellites known as exomoons. With over 4,000 exoplanets discovered so far, we know they exist in abundance throughout the universe. Hot Jupiters, with their massive size and fast rotation, are the easiest to detect. But there are countless other exoplanets waiting to be discovered. NASA's James Webb Space Telescope is unveiling the secrets of the universe, one discovery at a time. The telescope has been gathering data and capturing stunning images of the universe, revealing previously unknown wonders. Recently, it made a groundbreaking discovery that will forever change how we understand the universe. But that's not all. The James Webb Space Telescope has been busy capturing incredible images and gathering data about the universe. The stunning photos of star systems and dust clouds swirling and colliding into each other are truly captivating. The discoveries continue to come in from a global team of space experts. The telescope was used to catalog a detailed list of the coldest ice ever seen in a molecular cloud. They identified frozen forms of various molecules, including carbon disulfide, ammonia, and methane, as well as several common organic molecules like methanol and water.